Chupapi Munyeño. Today we're going to be talking about the Munyeño guy, better known as J Kind of Funny. And we know you've seen his videos on your For You page because I personally remember Munyeño being an inside joke for about a year. And I still hear people say Munyeño all the time, so he's clearly currently relevant as well. Hi guys, welcome to this episode of Famous News. I am your host, Stephanie Truco. So who is J Kind of Funny? Well, his real name is J, but he does go under J Kind of Funny 8 on Instagram and on TikTok. J is a popular American comedian, content creator, and TikTok personality. And he is better known for posting pranks and comedy videos online, with his content earning him over 22 million followers on TikTok alone. J began on TikTok November 17th of 2018 and uploaded his first YouTube video on his channel January of 2019. So he's been in the game for a while. Jay's first YouTube video was featuring saying goodbye to my Air Force friend, Emotional, which was posted January of 2019, and it honestly started off his career. Even though now his content is all comedy and games, this video was pretty emotional but had a slight comedy aspect to it. Jay is currently on track to hit 1 million subscribers on YouTube, and now currently he has had over 500 million views. Just on YouTube alone. Jay was also born August 18th, 2001, making him a Leo. And I was born August 24th, 2001, so he's only a couple days older than me. Eh. Jay was also born in the United States, making him a US citizen, and he also attended one of the best high schools in New York and graduated with good grades. And although Jay has several videos that are hits, he also has a few videos that have gotten him into quite a bit of trouble. So get this, back in December of 2020, Jay posted a video of himself crashing a shopping cart into a police car several times. And what happened? I think you can guess. He was arrested. <laughs> Even after explaining to the policemen that it was a prank, they seemingly just did not care. I mean, if you're gonna crash a shopping cart into someone's literal car for a prank, I don't think that's much of a prank. They took him in the car and they took him to the station because that's what prank videos get you these days. People just play too much. However, he was released literally the same day, I don't know how, but he ended up getting away with it. Not to mention his estimated net worth at the moment is $2 million, so I'm pretty sure he just paid whatever bond he needed and just went on his way. What do you guys think about the Munyeño guy? Let us know in the comments down below. Also, let us know who to feature next. We'll see you in the next episode. Bye guys.